Welcome to Pop Mart vs. Finding Unicorn. Today we are battling two All-Star series against each other. And you can vote in the comments and on my community page which series you think won. The first series is Finding Unicorn's All-Star Year of 3024. This series has 9 regulars and 9 special figures. There is 2 versions of each Finding Unicorn character and there is no secret in the series. And the special versions have the chance of 1 out of 90, so pretty hard to get. For the classic version, I wasn't a big fan of the color choices, so I only want Polar Strong, Future Eden, and Starry Dancer, who is my favorite out of them all. I do like a lot of the surprise specials. The colors are much more my vibe. My favorites are Pixel Boss and Cosmo Keeper, but Skywalker, Star Disco, Planet Conductor are also very cute. And I like Mercury and Galaxy Legend as well. It's just too bad these ones were so hard to get because I would buy a full case of them. Let's see who I get though. Maybe I'll get lucky and get one of the surprise special versions. And the bake for this series is okay, pretty basic, but I'm curious who's inside of it. Oh, I got the regular Repolar, he's so cute. I love his space suit, and oh look, he's a shaker. His backpack has glitter in it, that's fun, he's really cute. Let's have a look at the card for this series, this is Polar Strong. The Repolar Spaceman. Okay, but how cute is Repolar? He has an alien movie theme. If you know this scene from that movie, you totally get this figure. Repolar is such a cute spaceman and I love this backpack. It could have had more glitter in it, but it's just such a fun touch that it has glitter at all. I really like this series. I wish the purple designs were the regular designs instead of the specials because I'm not really a big orange-red color fan and that's why I didn't end up getting a full case but I really like this series and there's some really cute standouts. Our Repolar is just so cute and I really like how there is an option to get two different types of the characters. I find the designs are really fun. And this was our first series of Finding Unicorn for the year and it did start the trend where there's a certain amount per series that you can get as a special instead of a regular. Now that we've had a look at our Finding Unicorn series, let's have a look at its competitor, Pop Mart. The Zizlong Presents the Treasure series, which was the all-star series for Chinese New Year. We have 12 designs and one secret, however, this series has a twist very similar to our Finding Unicorn series. Each figure comes with an alternate special colorway, including the secret. For the regular version, we have mostly reds and pink colors, and obviously this is only a small portion of Pop Mart's many, many characters. I'm not a fan of red, as I've already said, so Fortune Long, Never Along, and Chill Long are my picks. Now the special colorways are 1 out of 144 chances, which is the normal chance as a secret, so they are pretty rare. And they are all the same figure, unlike Finding Unicorn, which were different designs. The vibes are a lot more Ice Dragon for our special colorways. And I gotta say, bless Spirit Long, our Skull Panda option is incredible. I also still like the Demu, Lilos, and Hachi Popo in this color too. Hirano and Pucky are definitely cuter though in this colorway. And let's not forget our secret Demu, Auspicious Lion. Demu is such a cutie, I love this figure, but it's one out of 288 chances, so... That is incredibly hard to get. Let's see if I got lucky though. There's a lot of Pop Mart characters I wouldn't want to get. So I'm just hoping for a character that I collect. Oh wow, it looks like I got Lilos. This is actually my first time unboxing this character. Here's the card for Never Along. I like the design. It feels special. I really love the metallic flames. And we got such a cute dragon mini accessory. This reminds me of an 80s cartoon. He's so cute and he's holding a dragon egg and then Lilos is holding him. And wow, I love this color. I'm so happy we didn't get a red one. I just love the pastel vibes and the clear vinyl. This is such a vibe. Does this mean I should buy a Lilo series now? Are they all this cute? I'm so happy with who I got for Long Presents the Treasure series. This series can be really hit or miss. 
Hallmark definitely has a lot of characters and designers with a very different style, especially when you compare it to Finding Unicorn whose designers are very different but kind of similar to each other. Definitely let me know down below in the comments which one you think is more of a gamble or who do you like the most characters of, Popmart or Finding Unicorn? I am really happy with my first Lilos though. I definitely need to pick up more because this character is cute. And here is both of the figures for each series. It's up to you to decide who won. I really like both of these so I think I would have a hard time picking. Go ahead and leave a comment here and then head over to my community page and vote on your favorite series. Pop Martin's You're the Dragon theme or Finding Unicorn's Futuristic Space Vibes. Make sure to come back tomorrow, I'll be opening up 30 mystery blind box figures. Can't wait to show you all of the cute designs, and I hope you have a great day.